we're watching a very special battle, and I've been waiting to watch this with the right crew, and I think we got the right crew fucking tonight. We got uh, Shoddy Hora versus Shuffle T, the Goat Bruvs going at it in a head-to-head -head clash on Premier Battles. I haven't watched any of this battle because I've been waiting to watch it on watch. It's probably the most suggested battle to watch. Is it? Ever, yeah. Like, whenever Ooh. I'm like, what should we watch? It's like, Shuffle and Shoddy. And then, that like, just dropped, so. Yeah. Yeah. So, we can get into it. You know, like, you got anything else you want to fucking talk about before we get into this shit? Nah, I'm excited to see this. Oh, uh, I guess a funny backstory was, like, when it, after it came out, Premiere was, like, at Premiere Battles or whatever, whoever runs it. I think it might be Briggsy. I don't know. But, uh, was like, oh, imagine, like, the views... Shuffle T and Shoddy Hora versus Ill Mac and Thesaurus would do. And like, Shuffle T's just like, damn, all right, just fuck Marlo, huh? You cunts. <laughs> like, you picked like the team and then, yeah, yeah. you know, two guys. <laughs> you know? Did you so. follow it up with something like you just started listing like. Two. Oh, yeah, I was like, yeah, you know, think Mario and Toad. <laughs> I was like, you know, Sherlock and, and what did I say, Sherlock and Wallace. Yeah. Oh, Watson and Gromit. <laughs> you know, <laughs> like, Jordan and Longley. <laughs> you know? Super funny. But yeah, I'm like, if we ever were going to battle the team, it'd probably be them, but it'd be Marlo and Shuffle. The OGs, come yeah, on. come on. Speaking of what, you got any interest in that? The bad you bar, give yeah. these these guys a sneak peek into the mind of the madness. Two the, on two, the two on two battle. Yeah, do you think do you think that will ever happen? You and Pete versus Shuffle and Marla. Well, uh, if any two on two battle was gonna happen, it it'd be that probably just because you know we've already battled Quest and Marv, you know, and it would have to be like a historical team for me. You know, um, but them, if they just meld so well, like that would be the thing I'd be open for, open to, you know, there's been other ideas that I think could be crazy, but I don't know to, I've said this before, but <coughs> Bless you. you know what I mean? Yeah, no, uh, I feel you. Two on twos just be hella like theatrical and shit. Like, mm -hmm. oh, you gotta fucking do a TikTok dance while you deliver a yeah, bar. Yeah. Swing your partner do -si do into a fucking, yeah. fucking assault rifle shape. You know? <laughs> like, it's just like, bro, I just want to rap. Like, I don't know, man. Yeah, I feel I'm not that. that interested. I feel that. Well, a lady can dream. <laughs> All right, let's get into this shit. If you're in the chat and you're not on uh, Ruin Your Day's Patreon, that's where all these go. There's been several watches and people are like, oh, when are you bringing watch back? Like, we've been doing it damn near weekly for, yeah, you know, for a while now. Yeah, almost twice a week we're doing watches, if not more. If I can get everybody to come over here. Do you? <clears throat> do you any, yeah. Like a... Um, these two guys battling, we're in a tag team. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, this dude on the left, Shuffle, usually battles in a tag team with Marlo. But this guy, Sh are you familiar with either one of these guys? Shuffle I've heard of, um, both, actually. Yeah, uh, Shoddy's like huge. Like he's yeah, like he's a big, of, legit he, artist. For the longest world. time, he had the the highest viewed English battle, oh, okay. which is Arsenal mm -hmm. versus Shoddy Hora. Which oh, okay. I wonder how much, how many views that has now. Um. Before Diz and Oxymiron decimated the world with that. Oh, yeah, uh, if you consider that in English. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah, that's just... Yeah, it's at 14 million views. <laughs> wow. Damn. Yeah, that's fucking that. insane. Yo, Arsenal, and the rematch is at two. That's pretty insane. Wow. Shout out CJ Halliday for the super chat and shout out for the love. Hell yeah, yeah. Dude. Dope. Come on, the I only fantasy you. cards. What up? When can we get an Ill Mac slash um, an X mini project? I mean, that's that's that'd be a crazy idea. I think after I do winter, I'm gonna go on a run where I just do like an EP a month and travel around and document it. And uh, I'm gonna go to Portland and do a project yeah. with you know Solomon. I'm gonna go okay. to Texas and do an album with Trox. I'm gonna go uh, and just like do a whole year of just an EP tight. every, yeah, every uh -huh. and document the whole process. So I don't know, maybe next year or in like seven and a half years or something. 
Hopefully soon. <laughs> yeah. All sincere. Hopefully yeah. soon. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna be a sarcastic dick. He's like, yeah. oh, <laughs> <laughs> Streets are starving. Yeah. Yeah, I'm like the biggest Ilmec fan if they don't know. That's why. Come on. Hell yeah. Drop shit. I like that about you. That's what you. got you here. Uh, <laughs> I like that up. you surround yourself with people that you're actually fans of. Yeah, That's no, cool. for sure. Definitely. Yeah. I need to try that. Yeah, me too. <laughs> That's the worst. Uh, by the way, that other super chat, <laughs> I don't know if you read it, but it said, oh, no, yeah. Zoo, you helped me through high school, passion, weed, and fat caps. Hi, another oh, love, song? Song. love song. Love song. Shout outs from St. Catharines, Ontario. Can't come on. That's dope, man. Let's Hell go. Yeah. You know what time Appreciate it is? Y'all. For real, for real. That's dope. Um, all right, let's get into this battle. Premier battles. Um, I love the way the Brits shoot battles. Salute to Liam Bagnall. He kind of like uh, him and Twiz kind of made this this style of shooting where they shoot on the stage out. I remember we've talked about this in the past, and you were kind of the person that convinced me not to do that. So damn. Yeah, but it was you're he right. Has the character. Yeah. <laughs> this is the so let's you. talk about this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Why do you hate? Yeah, Leo? why do you hate what I just com- complimented him <laughs> yeah, on? Yeah, but. There, it is problematic because like you want to battle towards the audience, not not one camera. So it's like makes sense. Everybody's you're gonna be seeing people's backs, but this shit looks so much doper than a fucking stage. Like yeah. the sea of yeah. people, you know. I like, yeah, yeah I they like capture it really well yeah. for sure. 100%. Like like me and Soul, I say that because it's like a battle where I've watched myself and how to balance performing to the camera but the crowd and mm-hmm. they're really good i think at like to where you see the performance even from behind you know hey, yo. yeah so nah this is super interesting let's get into it let's go hey, long live you say pasta long live pasta long live pasta long live pasta long live pasta come on okay five worldwide baby I wonder if this needs to come up at all. That yeah, that full shot he's done everything from like, you know, hip hop and like then like a punk album and shit like that. Oh, like the no. tour with like a band and all that shit. It's dope. Okay, fire. Premier Battles is fucking dope. I it's really fuck fire. with them. Like everything about them's cool. Like they do they take a lot of effort and put a lot of love into their product. Mm-hmm. They also like with the jerseys. They have like these teams. I don't know. It's just doing. Hey, I still want my trophy, man. I left a trophy from the U.S. out there from the event that I battled on, oh, shit. and it's like a trophy like this big. I'm like, I can't take this to customs. Like, mail it to me. But it's like you know, fifty pounds or something. Like, yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll mail it to you. Still don't got it, man. Dude, what's the craziest thing you've ever seen anybody bring on a plane before? I saw some dude bring a plant that I swear to God was six feet tall. It was huge. What? Yeah, me and Clayton were flying back from someplace doing the Grand Prix or something, and this mm-hmm. dude was like, this is like fun. We, I like just imagine he's a scientist or something. He's like, whoa! <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's like, it's like, it's like and stumbling. Start, it's like the origin <laughs> story of like swamp thing. Yeah, yeah swamp <laughs> thing. Yeah. The plane crashes and yeah. chemicals, chemicals spills. that were on the lamp spills yeah. onto the plant and yeah. binds with the scientist yeah. and someone's dog. Yeah. You know, someone's I mean? dog. <laughs> but have you seen anything crazy like that ever? Just a, a baby. Plane. Just just crazy. I feel like that's worst. crazy. Like that's a risk. Like, yeah. They might cry and everyone's gonna hit you. Like I'm they... always afraid they're like, I don't know, their head will pop or something. Like it's like a lot of pressure and they're just this little. They're just screaming in pain thing. and we're just yeah. like so annoying. Yeah, shut up. I do make an effort, like in those because I've been on planes where there's like really cr- loud ass baby crying, mm-hmm. like a roll yeah. over or whatever, mm-hmm. and I like. The mother or whoever's with them is always like looking around, like apologetically to anyone that looks their direction. I'll be like, oh, like "That's I, cool." Like because it's a baby. Yeah, you can't like, help it for sure, bro. If you wanted to, if you wanted to be picky and have an opinion, you should have flown private, you broke bitch. <laughs> you know, <laughs> or been in first class. Like you're sitting back with the peasants too, man. Yeah, you know, what I mean? yeah. like I don't. You have no place True. to judge. Anyone that's like, oh, I hate when people do this on a plane. Well, get money. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. You're like, you're broke. <laughs> Quit complaining. You put yourself there. You For know, you're, you're in a fucking <laughs> tube flying <laughs> across the state. Drive. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I feel that. 
feel that shit. But yeah, so shout out to uh, yeah. <laughs> Shuffle and, and uh, I, dude, I love Manchester too. The crowd is so it's fire. Soul, it's one, right? Yeah, it's one of my favorite uh, battle crowds. Really? Yeah. You yeah, haven't heard, man. Just been to London. Are you? You're not going to Man? It's just London on the yeah, tour. Yeah, just London. Yeah. Word. All right, let's get into it. Three, if you with us in the building, make some noise. Yeah! I keep thinking this, that Patreon's like a clickable ad. Like, I know, no, that's what I was thinking. I was like, damn, yeah. what you, But yeah. hey, smart. Yeah. Let's go. Sign up to the Patreon. Long time coming. I'm excited to announce this one on the left hand side. The manager of Shark City from Manchester makes some noise for shutting horror. Let's go. Yeah. And on my right hand side, no stranger to this stage, an absolute vet representing Knights, Shuffle Key. Let's go. Not the double hand way. <laughs> this is like the e like uh, accent wise, like posh English versus like you know working class Manchesterian. <laughs> you, know, you know what I mean? Hell yeah. Thanks for the season. It's a free round battle. Shotty decided to be starting round one. It's round one. Shotty holds it. Yeah. 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 When I say long live, you say pasta. Long live, pasta. Long live, pasta. Long live, pasta. Long live, pasta. Let's go. Some said I wasn't gonna, gonna show up. Hey. That's what the talk was about. I show up to the showdown to show up. <laughs> and show up. Dude, I love this. Dude, they just spit like so an eight dope. bar verse yeah. of, of his slogan, and he's just like mean mugging. Fucking amazing, <laughs> man. That's so dope. That's, that's, that's the, the weight that Shoddy holds out there. Yeah. Off rip. That's crazy. That's God, dope. that's so awesome. And he's a, he, he's a, he like does wrestling now. So he brings like the theatrics wow. of wrestling to battle rap. Like Another wrestling. thing that fools. That's yeah. dope. Yeah. 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 And so, shit. we've talked like, about like, this on recent episodes. Sometimes I feel like, ah, sometimes I feel like if you don't. Like the slogans, there are such a digression yeah. at the ends around. Yeah. But to start off Smart. with that and his participation yeah. and like mm -hmm. the weight that Shoddy holds, yeah. like already the energy's yeah. up. Super smart. I'm set, I want to show up. That's what the talk was about. I show up to the show, down to show up, and the show up on the ground. Yeah. 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 Ye
a month at least, you probably couldn't sleep. I guess trying to think of everything that rhymes with everything must come with some degree of pulling teeth. You telling Milo you can't go to this hot hunt retreat because of this humongous heap of things that rhyme with Ronnaby and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> telling Rowan you're not going to battle in some club in Leeds on Don't Flop rapping it hustle free because you've got a... <laughs> An upcoming book release, and I congratulated him like, you wrote a book? What an amazing guy. <laughs> when you hear he wrote a book, you thought I'd go to some of our greatest minds. I said, what's your book about? Space and time. <laughs> Ancient tribes. The economic crisis as we sit back and watch inflation rise. <laughs> no, 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 it's a novel. Something a little more on the creative vibe. No. Conspiracy theories. Children of the Matrix by David Icke. <laughs> Please, tell me the subject you're taking with this publication, because I cannot take the hype. <laughs> he looked me dead in the face and write, he said, I wrote a book about complicated rhymes. Yeah, multi-syllabics. Hey, shout out to David in the ch with the super chat. Appreciate Thanks, you. Thanks, brother. Dropping five on him. Come yeah, on. Yeah. Have to be done with your rapping with the. Yeah, multi-syllabics. They absolutely have to be done when you're rapping with a puncher, but like a puncher around for structure and pattern needs a strict function and fashion, but I'll allow for slight discrepancies depending on the native tongue and the accent, but that's. <laughs> That's hilarious. So, uh, Shuffle and Liam, who's filming, and this whole Kruger, and uh, Blaze, they they have this show called Sounds Like, too, and it's like a rhyming game show that they sure. do. Uh, I've been on it a couple of times. Okay. Fredo's been on it. Uh, uh, non sm has been on it. And uh, it's like each, it's literally like a game show where it's like uh, uh, they'll give trivia. But it's like the trivia is via rhyme. So it'll be like, it rhymes with this or whatever. And you got to like figure out. What yeah, yeah. But it's is. funny because oh, okay. all of it is like done. It's not one syllable rhymes, you mm -hmm. know what I mean? And there's yeah. also, there's different rounds of it. There's a whole bunch of different games. Okay. Like yeah. they make some up that just appear in that episode. Mm -hmm. One of them is like, basically they come up with a rhyme scheme and it's one on one. Mm -hmm. So now we got bar pong basically. Yeah, okay. And right. then the judges say who won. Like mm -hmm. you got like a minute or two minutes mm -hmm. or whatever and you just trade back and forth with someone on a different team because it's done in teams. <laughs> but sometimes the judging, I'll be like, I'm like, bro, that rhymes in your ass, <laughs> not mine. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> you know, yeah. like that doesn't, I couldn't even, totally. I'm thinking, uh, so, yeah. so it's like, you, I had to learn after my first one, like, okay, what would they be rhyming with right. that thing mm. on there, or whatever. So this whole angle, too, is just hella funny, because they really be on like, well, it's not quite a proper multi, yeah. you know what I'm saying? <laughs> It's an amazing show, by the way. If y'all haven't watched it, sounds like on YouTube. Okay, amazing. Good. Slight discrepancies depending on the native tongue and the accent, but that's... <laughs> that's <fine. laughs> <laughs> the, sh the show is called Sounds Like. I noticed like that's yeah, go peep the show. It sounds, sounds like, like and then wait, just what don't, is the show called? What is it called though? Yeah. We get what it sounds yeah, like. Yeah. It's called Sounds Like. <laughs> Multi-syllabics. <laughs> 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 they absolutely have to be done with rapping with a punch of the lack of a grammatical structure and pattern. <laughs> <laughs> Needs a strict function and fashion, but I'll allow for slight discrepancies depending on the native tongue and the accent, but that does come with an asterisk. And you know, <laughs> you know, <laughs> who needs to kiss a girl? <laughs> Oh. That stuff's just a distraction. I don't need direct sunlight or a shower, none of it. <laughs> Why would I go to a club and get plastered when I could stay at home, figure out the number of chapters and sit through my rejection email to see if the publishers haven't told me I need to <laughs> told me I need to be fucking embarrassed. Uh, I'm joking. 
He's kissed a girl before. <laughs> Have you kissed a girl? <laughs> <laughs> Daniel Barella, senior, appreciate the tan bomb. He said he needs that RYD hoodie in 3X. Hey, that's like $30 more expensive, but go, go. I think it's up there. I think we got those. The triple? Mm. At riderdie.com. Check Let's it out. Go. Maybe I'm wrong. Let's go. <laughs> riderdie.com. He's kissed a girl before. <laughs> in fact, Shuffle and his ex just finalized the fucking divorce. Ooh. Bitch wrote the man a rhyme for Valentine's. And he told her a Mullies was forced. <laughs> 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 the man even put in a score. <laughs> Giving us thunder a four. <laughs> she laughed it off. Oh my, Adam, it's funny for sure, but he says she should have known better, but it's something he just couldn't ignore. Especially now he's booked in the store, so he doesn't love her no more. <laughs> Fucking run for the door. <laughs> <laughs> fucking guy. Awkward as fuck, walking like he's got a wooden spine. Doesn't let you sing happy birthday to him because it doesn't rhyme. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> Wore his weird fucking trench coat a hundred times. Got you looking like you come disguised as some cunt that likes the under fives. <laughs> <laughs> Wore it so many times, he doesn't need to hang off his coat. He hasn't washed it in years. He takes it off and it stands on its own. <laughs> that coat is alive. <laughs> it's symbiosis. It demands the controls when attached to a host. I saw him put his hand inside said jacket and it actually moaned. <laughs> concept he about that wears. fucking jacket, jacket he does that, wear a always, lot yeah, yeah. that's so funny it's like man. batman like you, his closet is yeah, just, just a the bunch same of thing. the same coats yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but saying it's like a lie yeah ingenious his, yeah this is a hilarious video <laughs> It's been the same jacket for 10 years, or you've got 10 that stacks on a special rack like Dexter's lab. Each of them have a tiny pocket which contains a microscopic list of all the sex you've had. That cold screams! <laughs> that cold screams, why does she never text me back? <laughs> so dirty, every time he wears it, his neck gets chapped and his flesh is cracked with the reddish rash. I gave him a hook last week and my leg was scratched. I had to get a Dettol bath. <laughs> I had to get a Dettol bath for the tetanus jab. Fuck that coat! <laughs> <laughs> I've never known anything to smell as bad. It gets me mad when I see it. It makes me want to jet like a Pepsi ad for collecting pans. That, oh. that one's for the Netflix fam. Oh, oh, I was just about to say there's a special on Netflix called Where's My Jet. It's all about that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah someone the, like one a jet. One the sweepstakes or whatever. Yeah. 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 Wow. And, then, and then the fact I was just about to pause it to say that. He's on that one for my Netflix fam. And that. Oh. That one's for the Netflix fam. You get me, young. Wow. Yeah. 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 Yeah, this guy's like refreshing. Is she shoddy? Like just goofing around, and having fun. You know, yeah, a lot of yeah. his battles, he's he's pitted against serious opponents, so he has to be like okay, ultra right. serious. And this one, he's just goofing off. I think it's yeah. cool. Yeah, no, it is. It's super likable. He's he he's also just gets to flex. Like he always is intricate with his you know with his rhyme patterns and everything, but being able to flex it in this like more sort of it comes off more effortless it's yeah. not like this is where i'm gonna go into my rap my yeah, you, yeah. me rapping better yeah. than you you know it's yeah. like it's weaved into this com these comedic angles all the way through and he's but he's still flexing that muscle and the comedy at the same time mm -hmm. it, it, it is it's it's really interesting i like that hell the yeah free shoddy all right first on shuffle let's go it's like gray hoodie lux the carefree yeah, comedic shot. shot. <laughs> carefree right. shot. They're <laughs> gonna use you, huh? Everybody's been telling me I will never survive this next foe. 
I was never alive, been sentenced to life. They sent me to fry at death row. Mm. They've already supplied some fresh clothes, the burial site, the headstone. I'm dead on arrival, end of the line, but ready to die. So let's go! Okay. Okay. Sounds like it should be his new slogan. <laughs> yeah. You know, like it said it the way it was yeah. structured. Yeah. It was like a slogan, too. Shuffle, I got yeah. you. Yeah. Do that. Free tips. <laughs> That's why I've drafted a will. <laughs> now, I'd like, I'd like sounds like to continue, so I leave the registered rights to Pedro. <laughs> <laughs> And that's still on the register, ready to die, so let's go. I want sounds Pedro. like to continue, so I leave the registered rights to Pedro. Pedro <laughs> like, he brought that so crazy. same. Yeah. <laughs> and I want Big J to finally get that sexy designer trench coat. <laughs> and to Soul, I leave my engraved piece of Jefferson Price's bedpost. <laughs> And a really, really, really long collection of rhymes for Death Note. Because <laughs> I'm battling shoddy horror. Yeah? The genius. I mean it. In Manchester, this guy is Jesus. I am in utter shock. I am giddy. In pieces. <laughs> Is he wearing like sunglasses on his head? Yeah. That he's not wearing. Okay, okay. Yeah, I was yeah. like, his, I thought it was a like a head, like a oh, like a hair, like a beret, yeah, not yeah. a beret, but like a yeah. headband or hairband yeah. at first. He looks like uh, he and the Zulu. The, the way his like hair, because it's pulled back or like low in the front and kind of like all way. <laughs> he looks like a, the mad scientist in a in a. Like a, a a pandemic movie that came up with the oh, of course. That, came, that came up yeah. with the antidote, <laughs> yeah. and, but he's like rushing on it, like, like rushing it on like the bike guy with that brought that plane on the plane, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like, I'm a boy. That's the guy. Yeah, like <laughs> yeah. I gotta get there. You know yeah. what I mean? Like he's like yeah. back to the future. Like Twelve monkeys or something. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, exactly. That's who you. <laughs> 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 A shock, I am giddy in pieces, underprepared best man. I'm speechless. <laughs> they said shot he's back to battle and it's just like the olden days. Couldn't believe it. God's back, huh? Holy shoulder blade. <laughs> Well, fuck it, I'm back too. Well, stop Premier Battles. You already, you already know the Dizzle, been underground, now shuffs in town. Lock up your doors, Joseph Fritzel. He's an author. But this cancelled because of, you know, some controversial views okay. on. Uh, Eugenics. Eugenics. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's why Shot is like. Board. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> British, obviously. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's why Shot is like, oh, I don't co sign that. Those politics. Joseph Bristol! You know? <laughs> but this battle, was meant, this battle was meant to happen last April, honestly. This battle was meant to happen last April, honestly. He called it off. I was like, what? But mate, you promised me. <laughs> I asked if it's still happening, he's like, maybe, possibly. <laughs> I've been patiently waiting for this ancient prophecy. Too pussy to actually face me properly. He's pissing himself, scared that it'll take a loss to me. It's taking you- Wow. Who's in London for that, man? <laughs> He's pissing himself scared that it'll take a loss to me. It's taken you three prime ministers and a change of monarchy. <laughs> <laughs> I had that are now outdated due to that attitude. <laughs> Do you understand how many Chris Rock, Will Smith punchlines I just had? <laughs> and 
Organising an event and putting yourself as the headline is the worst, mate. It smacks of those kids who charge the other kids to come to their birthday. <laughs> We're having this class judged too by performers he would have to know because they rap for your platform, the sports arena that you own. <laughs> I, I, I wanted him to be like, because he's like, that, something worse, mate. Like, that's like the kids who you know, charge other kids to come to their own birthday. And they'd be like, I wanted him there. would <laughs> be like, don't ever sing that song. <laughs> you know, like, it's a conversation yeah, yeah. over a bottle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That song doesn't even slap. Yeah. <laughs> you know, that was, it's rubbish. Yeah, yeah, that song is rubbish. Because they rap for Clash Judge 2. But kids to come to their birthday. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That song doesn't even seismically get the rubbish going. It's like, it would be so Something like that, you know what I mean? That's it smacks those it. kids who charge the other kids to come to their birthday. <laughs> We're having this clash judged too by performers he would have to know because they rap for your platform, the sports arena that you own. <laughs> I can only imagine which way they all will see the battle go. <laughs> Unbiased as Kim Jong Un in a North Korean talent show. <laughs> I've also seen your battles, though. I've got you figured out, Roy's. <laughs> Simmer down, mate. You should be chilling out, boys. Think about it. All he has is a loud voice, but your writing's more of a shit show than Mrs. Brown's boys. <laughs> This is brown. I like it. I was well, I myself, you know. And it runs in Chris and Dad's voice, but I'm not even using it. Keep going! You hit mid-30s and went up about six dress sizes. You are a limping. You hit mid-30s and went up about six dress sizes. You are a limping, groaning, knuckle-dragging midlife crisis. I don't care about who's most popular, I care about who's the nicest. You have a bigger name than me, so does fucking ISIS. <laughs> and thin, but now he's addicted to working out and it's poisoned him. You on social media is an extremely annoying thing. My whole Twitter feed is you and Kojay just agreeing you enjoy the gym. <laughs> you do like the gym. Yeah, 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 where's this Twitter feed at? <laughs> yeah, send me a link. <laughs> yeah, let me join the party, come on. <laughs> I want the stick person that we've seen. This version baffles me. What's the rest Yeah, this one shoddy used to be hella skinny, you know? Yeah. Where it's like, dang, yeah, people would take... Yeah, yeah, he was yeah. working out. He was like into fight, like, I think training yeah, and I think shit. on some fighting yeah. and MMA like shit. Now it's like yeah, MMA. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> come on. It's a funny angle. It's on true. It's on true. You're right. We love the gym. I want the stick person that we've seen. This version baffles me. Who's to wrestle now? Well, I doubt we'll see a big surge in casualties. Such a fake guy, he'll only fake fight. He'll inverse to atrophy. Want to wrestle so bad? Go wrestle with your split personality. Oh, yeah. Split? Who? I'm hoping that by the end oh, of this, shit, head is John McAvoy. Yeah, damn. Oh shit. <laughs> Yo, me and Shuffle on the same way, <laughs> man. Come on. I'm praying and I'm hoping that by the end of this his head is fixed. I'm talking to him since it's clear a therapist never did. You on social media, you on social media's nuts. I mean, you've got this anger that brews. There's different versions of him. These doppelgangers you use. Someone said something you don't like. He's gotten mad in the mood. Now shot, he's back in the room. You're not the Adam we knew. This constant anxious is problematic. What's the matter? Stop the action. This rotten apple's gotten bad. He's lost and tangled. Shocking touch. You're not a man, you're a youth. That's not what Adam should do. Like everyone's against him. What an arrogant view, like you're the center of attention. Your logic has to improve. Not everybody's a snake, a shocking fact, but it's true. When you fall out with everyone, then the common factor is you. You fuck up relationships the moment you activate a computer. Telling friends you keep them to enemies <laughs> no, and those. Okay. That's, a, <laughs> yeah. That's amazing. Already, like, 
we, knowing Shuffle too, it's like that's the beginning of a new rise. Exactly. Yes. Because why activate. else would you activate say a activate a computer? Right. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. Activate. What's he gonna rhyme with that? Activate yeah. a computer. Like, Half his uh, mate. Yeah, you should have masturbated me sooner. <laughs> <laughs> For sure, that's what it's gonna be. <laughs> Definitely, hundred percent. It's true. When you f- and then you masquerade. Yo, you saw casting, <laughs> dis- dis- displaying your real feelings, and masquerading as humor. <laughs> you know masquerading, <laughs> definitely. Yeah, yeah, masquerading. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> Fall out with everyone, your logic has to improve. Not everybody's a snake, a shocking fact, but it's true. When you fall out with everyone, then the common factor is you. <laughs> you fuck up relationships the moment you activate a computer. Sending friends you keep into enemies, and those actions make you a user. Think St. Patrick's Day, I banish snakes. I am the saint of the future. I keep a head of serpents like Perseus, decapitate and Medusa. <laughs> Okay, I didn't see. Future it right there, yeah, duh. No, like, but then the why he wrote the book. Medusa, that, yeah, that's he wrote, why he wrote the book. book. Yeah, <laughs> that's what the source meant when he was battling uh, Kid Twist. Yeah, yeah. Because he's like, something when the guy who wrote the movie meets yeah, the man, guy who wrote, wrote the, the book. But he's yeah, really shuffle. saying, like, shuffle. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He was pointing across the ocean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Him. yeah because <laughs> where we were at in Canada, yeah, exactly. It was actually directly behind him. Head of Serpent Flutter. Think St. Patrick's Day. Yeah, this rhyme scheme is crazy you. too. You fuck up relationships the moment you activate a computer. Telling friends you keep into enemies and those actions make you a user. Think St. Patrick's Day. I banish snakes. I am the saint of the future. I keep a head of serpents like Perseus, decapitate and Medusa. That's crazy. So don't let his bullshit blur your vision. Don't be intimidated by a word he's written, because what he says isn't true like tabloid journalism, so don't be scared. Most horror stories are a work of fiction. Oh. Horror stories are a work of fiction. That round was Sorry. insane. Well, that I was crazy. I, I yeah. give it to Shuffle. Yeah. 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 I, I think, I mean, obviously, yeah, I think yeah, Shuffle. Sure, like, yeah. well, here's the thing. Why and why I was thinking that is sometimes this happens too where like how we were saying I like like when, when Shadi's like not as serious, right? Yeah. Uh, so he was almost more shuffle yeah, than shuffle funny. was because yeah, yeah. shuffle he had some funny shit yeah. but shuffle was like going yeah. for the throat yeah. though in his yeah. own way sure. and uh, I, I felt like shuffle's attacks were more direct where like a good amount of I think the first half of hey chitta mutta chase more in chase? the chat what up sure. but a good amount of uh, shoddy's like first half or, or maybe even a little more of his first round um amazing amazingly wrapped uh hella humor mixed with the like real rap ability and complex rhyme scheme yeah. but a lot of it <laughs> what <laughs> let's change that the up. split screen yeah, we, changed, we, changed, we switched I, it i take it back shoddy yeah. yeah. shoddy yeah. one up <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Johnny's going in the yeah, hot in his second real, round. Yeah, he's he's really yeah. commanding the room. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, man. that's so funny. Yeah. But that's but <laughs> basically, I thought that a lot of his early the uh, I loved the coat angle. It's hilarious. Yeah. It's something that hasn't been used. And you have to talk about the book, and he did that amazingly. Yeah. But I did feel like a lot of the 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 first like half of that round and maybe two thirds of it was, it was kind of on like you're a rap nerd with a book and there was a lot of funny stuff, but it wasn't, it, it could have been switched maybe earlier in another direct Into line of attack shit, put in yeah. there. You know what I mean? Totally. Because I felt like it was a lot of the sarcastic rhyming. Yeah. And then the juxtaposition of Shuffle, he's still funny throughout, but like he was going a little, like attacking more. Mm-hmm. Like the shit about him being like when, you know, have all these falling outs with people, the yeah. common factor is you. Yeah, like yeah. there was no jokes in that. You yeah, know what I yeah. mean? Uh, and he was rapping really well. Like mm-hmm. I, I think he just took a more direct approach, and it worked out for mm-hmm. him in that round. The way the rounds matched up. Yeah, I agree with that. Yeah, let's let's see what uh. <laughs> <laughs> let's see if we, uh, Shadi's lyrical supremacy. In the, in the, in the, He's alright, isn't he? <laughs> Probably someone 
With a case for top four, not many can joke as good as him. You normally know I'm gonna win, but today, you weren't sure. That's fine. <laughs> Bastards. <laughs> He's a formidable opponent. You're just living in the moment. That graveyard's been nothing but rusty chains and locked doors until Briggsy said, look, shuffle over. Well, then I made space for one more. Right. The most one-dimensional rapper. Just Zone, appreciate you in the chat. The 220. Thanks, brother. Babushka. Hey, the main babushka. The scene. Uh, Come on. For the last 10 years, he's given us nothing. The most one-dimensional rapper in the scene. For the last 10 years, he's given us nothing fresh. Just copies Ricky Gervais's whole shit and makes it right. <laughs> I'm unimpressed. I don't need to watch a shuffle battle to tell you what could have happened. It's formulaic. I could have guessed. Funny how you can't shuffle when we always know what's coming. I can't shuffle! That's crazy. That's crazy. We always call you shuffle when we I like how he didn't finish yeah. the line. Yeah, we too. always know what's oh, coming. Yeah. And then mm -hmm. yeah, that's you even know what's coming next. Even yeah. Yeah. yeah, so it's like I won't yeah. even. That's hard. Yeah, yeah. That really dope. good, really good. It's formulaic. I could have guessed. Funny how you can't shuffle <laughs> when we always know what's coming. I can't shuffle. Crazy. 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 I'll catch shuffle while he teaches his little rhyme and rap beginner classes. <laughs> Sliding past the guy who asked for ticket passes, but the knife that stashed. Within my jacket, slicing. Drive the jacket, shiver, fashion inside his abs, his liver splash, drive it back. The skin is dragging like the shite, he's nicking traction. He was battling balls and fucking final. They kind of class as mirror matches. Cause you're both full of gas and a thumb and index is something I can actually twist your cat with. Try, try me, try me. Act as if I'm chatting, don't die for rap cause it's in fashion. They wanted shuffle in the graveyard. Now it's time for Michael Jackson thriller dancing. I heard, I heard shuffles outside. I heard, I heard shuffles outside. Let's get this muppet outline. I don't give a fuck about rhymes. I got this gun from round mine. Me and my cousin. I said I heard shuffles outside. Let's get this muppet outline. I don't give a fuck about rhymes. I got this gun from round mine. Me and my cousin, downsized, it's just us in a brown ride and unho foot in his house like, give it up and your pal dies and Marlo stood there. <laughs> like, like, I don't mean to trouble you now guys, but... <laughs> <laughs> I've got lunch at about five and another function around nine, I'm just... <laughs> <laughs> it's a really good idea. I'm just worried about time. <laughs> gun button. Out lights. Blood coming out his mouth like you asked Gunner about slime. Aim at shuffle. Oh. Aim at shuffle. Let's go. And shuffle out cries. Are you just gonna fucking shoot me? <laughs> shh, shh. What does it sound like? <laughs> Why? Yeah, that's the theme song too. The, that's the sounds like? Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, that's fire as fuck. Yeah, that's, that's super crazy. Fire. Damn. Hit me. <laughs> what does it sound like? <laughs> crazy. Hold on, I wanna hear that one. Hey man, you ask Gunner about slime. Hey yeah. man, shuffle. Hey <laughs> man, shuffle. And shuffle out cries, are you just gonna fucking shoot me? <laughs> what does it sound like? Let's go! And Marlo stood there. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, fuck that! I'm outrageous! If I don't impress shuffle, I'll press shuffle without playing this. I'm the sensei. What's a sensation to an out section? Where would you have got with that? What's a sensation to an out section? Where would you have got without favors? Let's talk foundations. There's a difference between rock bottom and groundbreakers. If I'd have shown up today without patience, you'd be an outpatient or mortician. Shuffle on the table without Vegas. I am me. Without 
If I'd have shown on today without patience, you'd be an outpatient. Oh, Martian. Shuffle on the table without Vegas. I am me without a doubt, greatest. Out of town blazing, announcing a Mal Mason. You're just me without flavor, downgrade, and outdated. Shut it. Soul, Kruger, Bizzle, Bobby, Yunnan, you're about eight Wait, that's with Al Kay. I can't downplay it. <laughs> Fuck Shuffle T. I've been talking smoking. Loud statements. DJ with the drop on it. Shuffle on the floor like house waivers. <laughs> you rap. You rap. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't catch it. House ravers? Oh, 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 shuffle on the floor. With the drop on it. Shuffle on the floor like house ravers. Oh, yeah, that's crazy. Oh, that's crazy. You rap. You rap. <laughs> you rhyme words together really well. <laughs> That's why the people love you, but that's just one piece of the secret puzzle. That's like missing the scene, because you see the puddle. That's where you seem to struggle. You perform like your knees would buckle if you even push off a feeble muscle. You play do this with no conviction. Just like if someone that looks like him finds himself in legal trouble. He stays insecure, stood on the spot, looking like he needs a cuddle as he speaks so discreet and subtle. That's why we don't believe in you. So many elite MCs are leagues above you. We don't believe in stuff like the dealer hustle. Oh. You get it? You get it, but I ain't the gambling part. I told Briggsy we're gonna need to see the proper shuffle or it's gonna damage the cards. Yeah. We need to see the proper shuffle or it's gonna damage the cards. You think pretending to not have an ego is the cheat code? Like it's an invincible spell. He thinks if any MC is giving him hell, he just needs to giggle as well, and it isn't an L. <laughs> they both, Yo. they both like Yo. point at him. If any MC is giving him hell, he just giggle as well, and it isn't an L. Yeah, that's so good. Yeah, that's hella yeah. good. Like it's an invincible spell. He thinks if any MC is giving him hell, he just needs to giggle as well, and it isn't an L. <laughs> <laughs> You being the biggest you could be. If you don't believe it, we don't believe it as well. I mean, all oh, that self-deprecating only made you be little yourself. All that self-deprecating only made you be, be little, little yourself. yourself. That's fucking amazing. That's crazy. And yeah. rhyming that with the yeah, then it isn't an L. Yeah, that see that, that was he, he was part. attacking that yeah. round. That yeah. shit was crazy. That was fucking, second round for sure. Yeah, that was, that was fire great. as fuck. That whole rhyme scheme, great way to end it too. Really fire. <laughs> he's like Sarah, He's like I'm talking to you. I'm barking. Really good. <laughs> Let's go, let's go. Don't do it. You ever seen it? Have you seen the round that he's in, like, reason why they're cheering? So he's done it in multiple battles, right? Uh, I think but he's only done it in one. Oh, well, which one was that? Raptor. I've never seen. Okay, Raptor. He has, like, a conversation with his mom about, like, battling this dude, Raptor. I might have seen it. Yeah. Like yeah. He does like yeah, a bunch of conceptual familiar. rounds or like he does another round versus Heritage. He's like, no, I'm better he, than no. He does, he's on the phone for a while too. Yeah, like, yeah. He's like Raptor. Conversation. Raptor. Like, you know, like the dope. dinosaur. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like trying to explain to yeah. his mom. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. And then he has another round versus Heretic where he's like in the line to get a coffee and he's just telling him, he's like, I'm battling this dude named Heretic. <laughs> you know, it's like it sounds so stupid, but he yeah. does it so, so fucking good. well, and yeah. it's so ingenious. Yep. You bastard. I'm a little bit. <laughs> Here. Hey, yeah. Um, can I speak to someone in HR? <laughs> yeah, it's to do with uh, well-being and safeguards. <laughs> <laughs> Two nine one five is the number on my name card. <laughs> um, my place of work is Shotty Horace Graveyard. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> well, my, com 
fence are. <laughs> <laughs> I never get told when a new shipment of bodies is coming in. <laughs> which is a great start. I just have to wait for them to magically pop up on my radar. And I think he's in denial, because I know where the graves are. Shut up! I think he's in denial, because I know where the graves are, and he always says that he isn't, but he is running out of space fast. <laughs> If we ask too many questions, he just forces us out. He turns up some days and just orders us round. <laughs> he was meant to be in for a meeting at a quarter to now. <laughs> some are saying he won't show up. <laughs> this is so People are saying you. <laughs> that was awesome. That was awesome. <laughs> Fair fox. It's a hassle. It's a stress. It's, it's havoc. It's a mess. I just get batches of the dead turn up through National Express. <laughs> And if I so ask funny. how they died, that's a sackable offence. Am I to believe that he, what, rap battles them to death? <laughs> oh my god. Serious job. I'm, I'm, I'm calling today, because I've just had someone through, Tally. <laughs> Another hopeless victim. And I'm looking around and I've got no idea where the life of me I'm supposed to fit in. <laughs> No, that's taken. It's taken. It don't need filling. Well, I can put Tally in there, but he's going to have Tony with him. I get that these things are best handled with stealth. It's just, it's extra stress for me. Not handled with stealth. <laughs> I yeah, guess that these things are best handled, handled with stealth. stealth. <laughs> Amazing. I know there was something else. I know. I know there I know. was something else in that chapter. Yeah, come on. That you could have pulled. Come on. Up. You got a whole book. Yeah, you got a whole book to choose from, <laughs> yeah. Doc. Not handled with stealth. <laughs> no, look, yeah. I, I get that these things are best handled with stealth. It's just, it's extra stress for me, which is bad for my health. I guess I've just got to deal with the hand I was dealt. Yeah. What was your name again? All right, Briggsy. Well, thanks for your help. <laughs> Handled with yeah, stuff, yeah, his posh accent he, makes it. Yeah. He also the comedic timing and even like choosing not to to say the show out part of his slogan. Yeah. Like they just show up yeah. and like even uh, Shadi was like telegraphing it yeah. like to the crowd, like because it's just, well, show up to show out, like that being part of his slogan. So then like he's like, well, that's what they say, like like as if they said it on <laughs> yeah. the other line or whatever. Like, that's a genius decision that's, there. Yeah. That's why even Shadi's like, that was good, yeah. you know? But all his timing and delivery, like, he just, they, like, him and his partner Marlo, who's behind him, uh, they've, like, my fir the first time they came on my radar was the Bad Bars battle. Um, yeah. Where they battled each yeah, other. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. it was like me and Thesaurus battling each other. But their concept in the, at this time, this is like, don't flop, like, Heyday. This is like, yeah. I don't know, 10 years ago. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, it might have been like 20, maybe it was 10 years ago. Yeah. Uh, but it's like mid 2010s or whatever. Yeah. And um, it's called Bad Bars Battle. So their whole thing was doing a concept Terrible. of bad bars. Okay. But like bad bars as in like really bad wordplay. And low key, <laughs> yeah. it's Pretty like amazing. what's done now that the good writers do yeah. now <laughs> like it's funny because like, like example, you see how they do bad wordplay like back in the day we consider it bad now everyone's like if you oh said it god. now it'd be like oh my god that was so like you know <laughs> <laughs> i mean if fucking nitty said that it'd be i forgot crazy. who brought it out but i think it was, i think it was shovel he was like no it was marlo he's like for that i have a greater flip and he has a cheese grater that he just flips <laughs> yeah yeah like at the top of his round he just flips it <laughs> yeah. and then just puts it down I, one of my favorite parts was like 
Uh, I think it was Marlo, and he was like... Um, I think Marlo kind of won that battle. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, 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 for sure. But Marlo's had this bar. He was like, uh, oh, do you remember uh, Joseph uh, Joseph King that we went to, uh, from film school? And he's like, that we used to know way back, you know, from film school. And my, uh, Shuffle's like, yeah. And he's like, well, Joe King aside, I'll kill you. <laughs> <laughs> but like the setup, be like, oh, yeah, you know, you remember uh, Joseph uh, King, you know, from film school? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Joe well, King. Joe King aside, I'll kill you. <laughs> like, oh, that's like oh always one God. of our favorite bars. That is so But weird. So they have the history, but comedic time, like they used to do like hella com- comedy skits and shit yeah, yeah. like there, i remember someone i have yeah. such a bad memory but one with like oreos yeah, and oreos. some hilarious like yeah, skit yeah. but they just get comedy yeah, and that yeah. delivery They're and so timing good. works so well in battles yeah. you know what i mean yeah. when he combines it with his rhyme dictionary flowers you know what i'm saying yeah. <laughs> but I love it's a pretty Shuffle, solid man. package hey yo I'm glad he's laughing. Because usually he's terrifying. When he does smile, his face ID he doesn't recognize. But Andy put on a cracking amount of weight. Bit of padding around the face. You're the man of the house, it's great. But your calorie count's insane. But I'm not intimidated by you. That isn't how I'm raised. I don't feel fear next to you, I just feel massively out of shape. Now, I'm in terrible shape. He did beat me in that film Versus. But it was hard for me. It's so deprecating, Jim Rat. Oh, I'm a terrible yeah, yeah, yeah. My macros yeah, are off. Yeah, earlier he's like, I'm not even big. Yeah. I'm like, yeah, I feel this. Yeah, I'm you're like, same shit. Yeah, that's totally. scenario. Yeah. I have a terrible fear next to you. I just feel massively out of shape. Now, I have a terrible shape. He did beat me in that film Versus. But it was hard for me to lose that. Because I wrote my side of the thing and they said, we can't really use that. (laughs) It needs to be worse than Shotty's material, so could you write us a new rap? Worse than Shotty's stuff? I don't know if I can do that. (laughs) Yeah, Versus came out, that came out around the same time as Body did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was a movie? Yeah, Yeah, it was a battle rap movie that followed like a battle rap. Shotty was was the villain. Yeah, Shotty was the Diz, you know what I'm saying? in that in that movie, yeah, I think there theirs was a little more like serious yeah, in the dramatic serious. story or yeah, whatever. Yeah. But yeah, so you're talking about like I guess I didn't know I haven't seen it, but I didn't Shuffle, know Shuffle was, was in it. it. Yeah. yeah. Maybe it was just writing or whatever. Oh word. You yeah. Know? We're like, well it's gotta be a little worse. Yeah. Than <laughs> then shot they said, we cut this. That one. <laughs> I have he, a terrible shape. He did beat me in that film versus. But it was hard for me to lose that. Because I wrote my side of the thing and they said, we can't really use that. (laughs) It needs to be worse than Shotty's material, so could you write us a new rap? Worse than Shotty's stuff? I don't know if I can do that. In the end, I had to go through about a hundred thousand scripts to make my stuff as bad as what's coming out of that fucking mouth of his. At one point, I just screwed up a piece of paper and rubbed it round in shit. (laughs) The director said, I think we'll need to dumb it down a bit. I was in 8 Mile as well, you've seen it. Ah, it's genius as fuck. The producer called me personally and said, we need you for this stuff. I was meant to lose to Eminem, but the scenes have all been cut. Apparently, me getting beat wasn't believable enough. Yeah. Come yeah. on, British humor too. Like it's so, like that dry. Yeah, you know so what good. I mean? Like yeah, love it. Super yeah. sarcastic. Yeah, The Office, British Office. Yeah, greater than you know. Is it? I've heard. I've never seen both. it. Back in the day, yeah, I both. thought that like yeah. early on when I watched them both, but it's you only like the, what, like two seasons? Uh, like, yeah, it's only the like Americans a season like or way two. more than oh, the yeah. British one. It's just different because yeah, exactly. there's different things. Like yeah. Gervais is amazing, which yeah. is like Michael's character. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, I, I I thought the American Dwight was way better. Of course, but there was another character. Where I'm like that character is funnier in, on the British one. Oh, cool. um, Did they have like a romance like Pam and? Uh, I can't remember. It's not completely the same. There's some, uh, you know, differences, but uh, it was really good though. Yeah. But yeah, it's just different types of humor. You know what I mean? But some of that, some of that is so like, like 
awkward and like it's like secondhand embarrassing to watch on the on the mm-hmm. british one yeah um, yeah the, oh the yeah american one i can take but the british one is like they do it almost so well i'm just like oh, oh yeah God, like it's so dry dude <laughs> oh and they'll let you sit in that a discomfort yeah. a little yeah. bit yeah. that's like part of the like yeah. you know humor as part of the yeah. masochistic fucking yeah. british yeah. Cult, culture of humor totally, <laughs> you know? totally. but he's a master at it <laughs> Me and Funny go together like bees and honey. Easy money, heretic and a vegan curry. But it's a, <laughs> heretic and a vegan curry, but it's an under, understatement if you're describing me as hungry. That's like calling Ian Huntley a cheeky monkey. <laughs> I should have bought an armchair, slippers, and a dressing gown. You can get Briggsy up here as well, man. Fuck it, just for a laugh. We can turn this into a 1v1 and a half. Because <laughs> <laughs> look at all the people that you need to bring with you the second that a battle's not inside of the M62. I could have had this battle in your house, in your parents' living room, and had them both arguing over who they give it to. Your mum gives it to me. Now. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, and honestly, hide in a safe space, because this could cost you your life, and that is fucking mates rakes. I am in here. It's an offer. Mace race. I am in here there, to man. have a couple of quick beers and slow oh, life, and that is fucking mates rakes. I am oh, and honestly, hide in a safe oh, space, because this could cost you your life, and that is fucking mates rakes. Yeah, I am yeah. in here. Mates rakes. I am in here there, to man. have a couple of quick beers and slay. I don't care if the sharks are the knights are the ones that win here today. Don't get that misconstrued. I mean, my win's clear on stage. I just don't care about the teams because I'm not six years of age. <laughs> <laughs> I have out of ten, I give myself a million. I am my own worst critic, and I think I'm fucking brilliant. <laughs> well done. That's so good. I think I seen that clip on my IG. Yeah. Like, fuck it, the I'm my fucking, I'm my biggest critic, and I think I'm fucking brilliant. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I love that. <laughs> performance I have out of ten I give myself a million. I am my own worst critic and I think I'm fucking brilliant. So So fuck it, the round's done. Got his back to the turnbuckle. Now let's see how many more puns this cunt has for the word shuffle. Not playing defense at the end of this round too, you know what I mean? Incredible thugs. Whew, that's a tough round. I, I think that's really close. Yeah, it is. I do think that round is closer than the first. Definitely. I mean, I'm, I'm kind of leaning towards shoddy a little bit, to be honest with you. But it's like you could fucking go whatever way you want. What do you honestly. think? Shoddy, for sure. Shoddy? I, 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 I like Shuffle, bro. I yeah. Like, yeah, like, Shuffle. Yeah, I, I see. I, I, I don't just, blame you. I like you. his take a lot. Like his humor, it just connects with me more. Yeah. For real. Not to say... Shoddy wasn't going off. Yeah, it's just I uh, just preferred shuffles, but they both went crazy. Yeah, I'm really on the fence because I think, like, I liked the last half of Shuffles round, but I feel like Shoddy might have ended better. Mm. Like the I'm think I'm fucking brilliant, and then kind of is like a defensive, and and it was just not really attacking at the last portion of his round yeah. now, there was stuff i didn't fully catch but like yeah shoddy was going for the throat the whole round and especially the ending but it's tough because i think the first half of shoddy's round the like call the graveyard thing is like my favorite thing oh, so uh, far yeah, in the battle round. Okay, shuffles round sorry yeah, yeah, yeah. but that that the first half of shuffles round yeah was like with the call True. on the graveyard yeah, is like my favorite best. thing so right. far in the battle You're right so yeah. it's like fuck i'm not yeah, sure yeah, because yeah. I do think yeah, I'm kind of leaning. Shoddy, shoddy was like yeah. stronger attacking, and I yeah, and 
the ended stronger, especially the whole second half yeah. of the round. But that first part of Shuffle's so round was open. so good that yeah. I, I, I damn near have to call it a draw, mm. which is like, I don't know. So one. I, I'm, I'm so on the fence, and I hate yeah. being like, you know, yeah. I'm not being political. That's how I feel, though. Shot it was like stronger and more yeah. attacking, but yeah. this this part part of the Shuffle's round is my favorite thing yeah. so yeah. far. Yeah. How do you I measure feel that? that you I know? feel that. It's tough. Great battle. It's a mark of a great battle to have something like that. Yeah. Hard decision. For sure. <laughs> I mean, Shovel T is funny as fuck, I mean. Yes, yeah. I've been quoting him when he's roasting him. As far as the stand up comedy rap battle fans go, it's either Roche or him to be the GOAT for them, but there's this Joe Pesci notion. <laughs> funny how. <laughs> if you're focusing. Because there's two types of funny in this world, bro. And you're both, both of them. Because <laughs> you're funny, like you're funny when they're loving you clowning. But you're funny, like there's really something funny about it. Because <laughs> I don't fuck my friends over. You get bad luck from me. Pussy tried being a stand up guy before you tried being a stand up comic. <laughs> Cause no matter what Kruger and Bags do for this lad, you know his team rolling forever. Oh. He literally robbed your friends of their business, but as soon as he DM'd you, you instantly fall to the pressure. He's paying you with the money that he owes to them. Oh. Don't act like you didn't know any better. Crazy that you made a paperback when you was the staple that didn't have the spine to hold it together. Oh. that you made a paperback when you were the staple that didn't have the spine to hold it together that's that's, insane. that's, that's insane really that's, Holy really shit. that's insane mm -hmm. yeah like he's talking about it hit bro when it yeah, shuffles yeah, yeah. homies bread and then still taking a battle i think or whatever or yeah something. he still fucks with and then yeah. they're still fucking with him yeah. and then then like he pays you mm -hmm. with what he owes them. Like so don't crazy. act like you didn't know any better. That's crazy. Crazy that you made a paperback when you're the staple that mm -hmm. didn't have a spine to hold it together. Yeah, it's dude. Good. Yeah. yeah. I'd have cut staple out of that and just said when you didn't have the spine to hold it together. Mm -hmm. But you know. Yeah. 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 <laughs> crazy. That's insane. Yeah. That's yeah. insane. Yeah. That's insane. Punch, great wordplay, yeah. scheme, and a punch, but yeah. that's a direct attack. Yeah, yeah. you know, yeah, yeah. I always yeah, preach that. Just anybody. You, you know? gave me a book, cool. Like you gave me things that have to do with books, cool. But when you make it not only good wordplay but attack, mm -hmm. I yeah, love because it. even I'm when happy. he was going into that, he's like, "You're a stand-up guy." I'm like, I've never heard anybody say anything about about shop. I'm like, "What the fuck yeah. is this?" I'm yeah, like, I kind of yeah, I was kind of feeling like yeah. that too. So then he gives you the and then thing I was like, oh, and shit, punches damn, with it. Yeah, that's really hard, far, really so far. To all dicks and crazy money that I owe sent you, you instantly fall to the pressure. Also, He's I've never heard anybody bring this up in a battle yet in the UK. Maybe I'm fucking really wrong mm -hmm. because it happened so long ago that it's surprising nobody ever talked about it. They talked about it in like fucking blogs and shit like that. What? What's the specific thing? I mean, the down flop, the like basically oh, the reason why down flop crumbled. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, Ur owed Krugel, Kruger and uh, Liam a shit ton of money, I guess, and then he's like, "We're not paying you." So. I mean, that's the gist I got. I could have right. the details wrong. But, right, right, yeah, right. Whatever. The battle Peggy. rap. Yeah, the battle rap stuff. Selling circle. Yeah, exactly. Gotcha. And you, with the money that I owe to them, <laughs> don't act like you didn't know any better. Crazy that you made a paperback when you was the staple that didn't have the spine to hold it together. Wait, why, why would you remove staple? Doesn't that rhyme with paper? It does. It's a good. Well, it's staple that and crazy that and paperback. Yeah, staple mm -hmm. that. Right. Okay, so you would just get rid of staple then? Well, the, I, I'll just on some writer shit because it's like. Uh, What's the double on staple? Oh, so the, you're a staple, blood. like you're a staple in the community or a staple yeah. in the battle rap scene. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. You know what I mean? But it's almost complimentary. You know what mm. I mean? But it's acknowledging. It's not bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but also, I almost wanted to hear the rhyme earlier. And uh, you accomplished okay. the same thing. Like, yeah. it's in crazy that paperback when you didn't have a spine that could hold it together yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. but I feel it, that. It, it works both ways and it's i just actually caught that it was 
more of an internal. Word. Word. Either way. It works either way. It's great writing. So I like you didn't know any better. Crazy that you made a paper back when you was the staple that didn't have the spine to hold it together. <laughs> He does not give a fuck. He does not give a fuck. I've never met anybody in mm. To add to our point, so chat, a couple of people in chat bring up the good point too that a paperback doesn't have staples. A paperback mm -hmm. I thought that's is why you glue. It. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that adds to my. <clears throat> oh. People keep thinking uh, Bobby's uh, hollow. Hollow. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, let's just, light, yeah. let's yeah. change yeah. the title. To that. <laughs> <laughs> Funny thing is, I'm I'm doing a watch with Hollow tomorrow. So. Oh, fire! So yeah. Hollow's out here. Yeah, you want to roll through? I might be down to roll through. Hell yeah, yeah. it'll be sick. It's because he wears the dad hats and like the shadows come right, over yeah. your That's face. That's really funny. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He does not give a fuck. He does not give a fuck. I've never met anybody as bold as he is. Could you imagine him, Kruger and Bagnall on Zoom as they host a meeting for the Sounds Like show that evening? And he's tangent off in a don't flop, the whole case, the whole proceedings. He sat there like, what's a cunt? <laughs> what's a cunt? Sorry guys, that's my phone. Hello, Rose. <laughs> Keating? Always love Ronan Keating. Hello, Ronan Keating. He does not give a fuck. You need to understand that shit he did with Liam and Freddie, that shit made us sick. They ain't just anybody's. Without them, I don't think the scene you see today exists. I'm not saying you're a piece of shit because you didn't hold it down. I'm not saying you ain't legit because he tried doing the same shit to my brother and we squatted up and created this. <laughs> Fire. Royal to the side. I don't fuck with anyone that wants to play with bricks. You don't like him, I don't like you. Simple, plain as shit. Yeah. That's why our careers me a fork in the road. And they separate like this. Cause you're still maintaining a main event career and getting away from it. And I'm the guy that pays you it. Oh. And I did your little panel show for free twice. It was COVID times. I let the love persuade me. <laughs> <laughs> you couldn't sell tickets, make money. There was no crowd. Stuff was crazy. You came at me with the whole with friends angle. And I bought it. Because me charging shuffle shady. Until we needed you during the pandemic and your attitude was fuck you, pay me. Oh. So fuck shuffle tea and his book and his infiltrating gentrification in the class. Oh, yes. oh. These pots couldn't see what the streets created with the scraps yeah. and want to turn it into data in a nap. Yeah. Oh. Click this link and learn how to be hip hop. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> I said click. Fuck off! What the streets created with the raps and what these cunts see what the streets created with the raps and want to turn that turn it into data in an app. <laughs> That's crazy. This little I want to turn class. Apple oh, yeah. and his book and his infiltrating gentrification in the class. Oh, yeah. oh, oh. These pots couldn't see what the streets created with the scraps I want to turn it into data in an app. Yeah. Oh. Click this link and learn how to be hip hop. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> <laughs> I said, so clip this video. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> Yo, somebody needs to clip that just for that. Twitter. We just yeah, well, I just need that everything. as a gift. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> we ain't got I said, click this link and learn how to be hip hop. <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> we ain't got the patience for all that. For your book to be useful to me, I'd have to tape it to my app so I was safe from getting stuck. Ooh. I didn't learn this shit from a fucking book. Hold on, man. This is crazy. Really got nice. yeah. They'll be knifed up. Fuck off. Uh, we ain't got the patience for all that. 
For your book to be useful to me, I'd have to tape it to my app so I was safe from getting stuck. That's crazy. I didn't learn any that kind of got slapped book. on, low yeah, key. I felt like th 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 for some reason he's lost the crowd a little bit. Like yeah. that's what it feels like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Since a little bit ago, he said something that was fire too. Mm -hmm. uh, before even the data in an app thing, where I'm like, that was crazy, and I feel like. He's not getting the big crowd pops. Yeah, someone was saying that they think the a choke guy edited out. Edit. There yeah. was kind of an awkward moment where he's like and walking around. And if there was around. a choke edited out, that's probably when Maybe he lost, he lost yeah. a little moment. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because he's kind of getting slept on. This shit's crazy. Yeah, true that. Patience for all that. For your book to be useful to me, I'd have to tape it to my app so I was safe from getting stuck. That's crazy. I didn't learn this shit from a fucking book. I was battling on the street corner since I had a bus pass and a pocket full of dust caps. People hate us. People hate us. Fuck that. I handled the positive and the negative like a blood bank. Me. <laughs> You one on one ain't a good match because I've always been a couple points above you, like an online. Listen, oh, <laughs> next thing I want to talk about is very fucking serious. <laughs> it's not a joke because I don't trust a man whose arms don't move when he walks. <laughs> <laughs> it's one of those. It's one of those. Next thing I want to talk about is serious. I don't trust a man whose arms don't move when he walk. It's one of those. Why do your arms look so heavy, bro? I got no. You look like every single parent on the council estate trying to carry your mum's worth of shopping on. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking strange guy. <laughs> Looking like a little man in black and alien inside him can't operate the arms and legs at the same time. <laughs> And thank you very much. Another straight white male with a podcast. <laughs> with, with long hair and edgy jokes. It's fucking Russell Offbrand. <laughs> yeah, Russell Offbrand. That's amazing. That's so good. <laughs> That's good. That's really good. That's me. Thank you. <laughs> Good round. Good fucking round. Yeah. Now your music has actually been a little different lately. When you up and switch so fucking quick, it comes across as shady. That Scum of the Earth album was so Oasis influenced, it was crazy. I said, do you think you might have ripped them off a bit? She said, maybe. Maybe. Yeah. I said, yeah, definitely, maybe. Yeah, definitely, maybe. I said, yeah, definitely, maybe. I said, yeah, definitely, maybe. Now, look, like, here's what. Well, th th that's funny, too, bringing up that. I just watched that there's a show called This Is Pop on Netflix and every episode is like a different thing about like pop music. You know, there's like the first episode's Boys to Men, the second one's about like auto tune, a lot of around mm -hmm. T Pain. Uh, but one of them is uh like the British invasion essentially or whatever. Well, British invasion that was like Beatles and all that shit, right? Mm -hmm. It's like this Brit Brit pop or whatever, but there's a big part about uh the beef between Oasis and uh, oh my god, of course I'm forgetting. Um the other big Brit Brit pop band, Connor, who who Sex do they, Pistols. <laughs> nah, who do, who are they beefing with? Like it, the point is the is Beatles is that uh this battle kind of mirrors that rivalry yeah, 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 because yeah. oasis was like manchester like yeah. working class a little grimy and this other band was like the like london and it was more like the one of the biggest hits or one at this time in the beef was uh uh it's called like country house or something like that, where they're literally talking about like having a country house yeah, or whatever. Blur, blur. Oh, da, da, da. Blur. yeah. So they were hella beefing at the time, and there was like a literal battle for the charts and shit. Oh. And it, it it was in the media and such a big story, but mm -hmm. the, a lot of the undertone of it and people picking sides was because it was like, oh, the posh London 
like you know what I mean, bubbly crowd, and then the Manchestery, more grimy, okay, like right, pub. Right, right. And this battle is like kind of like that dynamic. Yeah, you totally. know what I mean? The posh, and then the grimy, even yeah. the angles they're yeah, taking. Yeah, for real. So for real. there's like significance to that. I wonder if he like touch on it all. But interesting. Pose. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I said yeah, definitely. <laughs> From Blair. I, I don't know. Yeah, it's it is right. It is. Yeah, yeah. Mm. yeah that's crazy. I was like, <laughs> it was like pretty recently that I discovered the gorillas was one person. Too. Oh really? Yeah, what? I, I didn't like, know that. Like, I thought uh, it was a group for. Stanley I thought it was Deltron Thirty Thirties fucking dude. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah there's like a sample ran. or something. <laughs> yeah, Yeah, definitely, maybe. Damon Abram. Yeah, definitely, maybe. Now, look, here's what I think happened. I think he started copying them little by little. Terrible, terrible vision, man. Yeah, same here. I said, yeah, definitely, maybe. Now, look, here's what I think happened. I think he started copying them little by little. Then you just roll with it. Heads up in the clouds. I mean, he doesn't hear it. Makes him wonder what the fuss is about. <laughs> <laughs> also, in that episode, it's funny because the bros talk. They're like, like one. It flashes to one critic, and they're like, "Yeah, no, everyone talks about great songwriting, but like Oasis is amazing. Like, despite." Not that great a songwriting or whatever. It's like a contrary to opinion, but and then it flashes to Brett, like the whoever wrote the song. I don't remember if it's the lead or not, but uh, uh, he's like, they're like, oh yeah, like where did Wonderwall come from? He's like, I don't know. Like I got to that point, which was, uh, you're gonna be my like he like sings it and he's like, be my. He's like, and I looked over and there's a George Harrison album that was like called. Uh, I don't know if it's a single or album, but it's like Brick in the Wonderwall or something like that. And he's like, oh, yeah, Wonderwall. That rhymes. Because he had the <laughs> He's like, yeah, that. He's like, I don't, it doesn't really mean That's anything. Amazing, <laughs> you know? Yeah. Love that. Yeah. The wall, the I think he started copying them little by little. <laughs> <laughs> then you just roll with it. <laughs> Heads up in the clouds. I mean, he doesn't hear it. Makes him wonder what the fuss is about. <laughs> no, oh. Oh. No, one, no one's more pissed off than me. No one's more pissed off than me. I liked how your old album sounds. In fact, I don't believe that anybody feels the way I do about you. <laughs> That's hilarious. Don't look back in anger. You're right. You blended Britpop and hip hop with rock. Thought it would be shit hot. Big shock, it's not. <laughs> you ripped off a band you like, and yeah, you did it beautifully, but musically, now you're nowhere near as good as you used to be. Because when you sell out your art for a dime, it'll never be far from your mind. Because when you've been cast to the side, those steps are a bastard to climb. Your energy starved and you'll try, but never regrasp on those heights. Your penmanship starts to decline. Your presence, your bars and your lines, and everything's harder to rhyme. Oh. Integrity's hard to define, but when you pretend to be part of the life of a celebrity's art that you like, all you're doing is karaoke. You dress up, you dance, and you mime. So that's why... Fuck you, man. Stop doing this. <laughs> this is crazy, this is though. Nice. This is nice. He's breaking some shit yeah, down right so now. So insane, dude. Part of a life Big of a celebrity's up. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Brit pop. In hip hop with rock, <laughs> <laughs> you thought it'd be She's shit hot. hot, big shot. It's <laughs> not. <laughs> so fire. So good, dude. Far from your mind, because when you've been cast to the side, those steps are a mm. You did it beautifully, but musically, now you're not. I want to hear this whole. Thought it would. <laughs> you blended Brit pop and hip hop with rock. Thought it would be shit hot, big shot. It's not. <laughs> you ripped yeah. off a band you like, and yeah, you did it beautifully, but musically, now you're nowhere near as good as you used to be. Because when you sell out your art for a dime, it'll never be far from your mind. Because when you've been cast to the side, those steps are a bastard to climb. Your energy starved and you'll try, but never regrasp on those heights. Your penmanship starts to decline. Your presence, your bars and your lines, and everything's harder to rhyme. Oh. Integrity's hard to define, but when you pretend to be part of a life of a celebrity's art that you like, all you're doing is karaoke. You dress up, you dance, and you mime. So that's why... Fuck you, man. Stop doing this. <laughs> <laughs> you stop. Stop doing this. All you're doing is karaoke. 
mind. You dress up, you dance in your mind. So all you've actually done is perfected the art of disguise. That's why you're running out of smoke like a contestant and stars in their eyes. Tonight, Matthew, I'm going to shove. Tonight, Matthew, I'm going to shove Noel Gallagher's dick in every hole that I can fit. That's the only role that you can give. This ain't the old stuff. <laughs> this old shouty is like hella distracting right now. Like it looks like he's like dick trying, trying to find a game token. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's like digging in his pockets and he's just game like, <laughs> yeah. just yeah. about it. Yeah, yeah. Still got that coin. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I got shuffles back in. <laughs> yeah. Hey yo. Yeah. Oh my Trying to dig it. Yeah. Dick shuffles back in now. Uh, <laughs> hey, yo. Hey, yo. Hey, I mean, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. You know that. yeah of his pocket. Of his pants. Yeah. He said trying to get shuffles back in. Trying to dig shuffles oh, back, back in. Yeah. Back in. Yeah. From his pants. From, From his pocket. His yeah, yeah. His, yeah. <laughs> obviously. Yeah. Yeah. While you're running out of smoke like a contestant and stars in their eyes. Oh. Tonight, Matthew, I'm you know you're searching for something if you reach in your right pocket with your left hand. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, like, like you're carrying groceries like, type like, shit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah like, like you're carrying groceries yeah, and you're, you're like, to, like oh, open the yeah, door with the keys your elbow. in the wrong. Yeah, like, yeah, oh my god. Oh, I, fucking I thought I did dog. this right. Like yeah. I thought yeah. I grabbed yeah. it with the right. God, it's the most annoying shit ever. You like have to like switch the arms and do the reach over. Fucking fruit falls out the top. It's the worst, bro. Your mind, so all. Or especially if you're like have a coffee too, oh, God, but you forget, yeah. so you're like, yeah, oh, yeah. and then you start spilling yeah. it off. <laughs> oh my God, that happened to me that literally two oh, days God. ago. <laughs> You dress up, you dance in your mind, so all you've actually done is perfected the art of disguise. That's why you're running out of smoke like a contestant and stars in their eyes. Crazy. Tonight, Matthew, I'm going to shove. Tonight, Matthew, I'm going to shove Noel Gallagher's dick in every hole that I can fit. That's the only role that you can give. This ain't the old slap on the wrist, you're facing the whole caliber list. No, you're facing the whole character list of Soul Caliber 6. That's why he's saying shit lines these days like. It tally and blood run in the streets. Oh my Fire. god. You're such a prick. Oh, <laughs> oh, the Manny crowd were loving it. Most people wouldn't fuck with it. I was just watching with a confused face. I couldn't keep up with it. <laughs> Not because it's too complex, just because it's fucking shit. <laughs> it tally and blood run in the streets. I'll slow it down. I'm out maneuvering. <laughs> I'm getting a bit too complex, so. Let me do some tutoring. See, I said something. <laughs> See, I said something about the mafia. <laughs> but I included in his pseudonym. Oh my god, dude, that's insane. That impression is really yeah, fucking yeah, good, yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah. Something about the mafia. <laughs> <laughs> But I included in his pseudonym. I didn't give a shit if you crammed his name in there, it's still a fuck all to do with him. <laughs> Let me say something simple and make it official. Battle rap bars aren't personal just because their name or initial is placed in the middle. Every, every round Talk. from you these days is just this. Talk. Like to everyone, you, message right to everyone. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Everyone, Say overseas, underseas, <laughs> on this seas. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Take some notes. It's placed in the middle. Right. Battle rap bars aren't personal just because their name or initial is placed in the middle. Right. Yeah. Every, every round from you these days is just this crazy, horrid scheme. You make it sound complex, but it's the same obnoxious theme. People used to be able to battle in a way they want to speak. Whatever happened to just fucking saying what you mean? Yeah. Speaking my love language know, right dude. now. Yeah, it's proposing. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, are we Sorry. doing this? Are we doing yeah, this? Do we just become <laughs> best friends? Mates rates? Fucking sex, we used to be able to battle in a way you make it sound complex, but it's the same obnoxious theme. People used to be able to battle in a way they want to speak. Whatever happened to just fucking saying what you mean? <laughs> Every line is I said one thing that sounds like another thing. Isn't that clever? And I'm just watching from the side like mate. 
It isn't that clever. <laughs> so I won't dress this up in wordplay, I'll just tell you what the truth is. I think insecurity is the reason you became a unit. Your battles aren't that great these days, neither is your music. I think you're overrated and I think you're fucking stupid. <laughs> this is loud mouth bullshit. This is loud mouth bullshit versus strong and silent. You make something simple feel like rocket science. I make, I make rocket science feel like comic timing, like Q and Laurie the two. Come on. Hard, bro. Come on. What? Fuck. <laughs> Damn. Science feels strong and silent. You make something simple. Mouth bullshit. This is loud mouth bullshit versus strong and silent. You make something simple feel like rocket science. I make I make rocket science feel like comic timing, like Q and Laurie the two. This is loud mouth bullshit versus strong and silent. You make something simple feel like rocket science. I make rocket science feel like comic timing, like Hugh Laurie, the two Ronnies, and Monty Python. So it doesn't make an ounce of difference how you spin it, which way round you flip it, upside down and twisted. I am bound to win this, and the crowd can witness this counterfeited coward's limits. There's always praise for you, and you're showered with it, put on a pedestal, like some proud exhibit. They put you in their top four, they've mapped out your image. Well, you can take Mount Rushmore, I'll take Mount Olympus. Wow. You can take Mount Rushmore. I'll take Mount Olympus. You say I'm a clown as if it means that I'm annoyed. I love that reputation, that's my pride and joy. So go find some roids, alright, and joy. Take that belt to its biting point. I'll just kick you in the bollocks with my clown shoes so I'll have a higher voice than a choir voice. Listen, if you're watching from overseas, Watch more UK battle rap. Watch, watch Frankie Frost, O'Shea, Koji, Gemini. It's action packed. Watch Premier Battles, don't flop, no loose chat. Fuck it. Watch some Danny Jack. <laughs> just, just, stop, just stop giving your attention to this overrated fucking twat. <laughs> I've hit you with wordplay angles, aggression concepts, this battle's what I make it. You just forever rely on Americanized, generically rhymed name flips. You're an imitator. You see what's out there and you claim it. I'm an innovator. I see what's out there and I change it. Yeah, that is gonna go. That was crazy. Um, Damn, son. Yeah, I think Shuffle got that pretty yeah. clear. Um, I, yeah, three zero to me. But yeah. but Shotty was crazy too. Shotty was really good. Honestly though, too like, I don't know if maybe Shotty felt like he was losing, but his yeah, defense mm -hmm. during shuffles made it seem like you knew you were losing. Yeah, yeah, yeah for like real. you're trying to do a little too much. Yeah. that's distracting, yeah, that's and you're also like not doing it to the crowd. You're doing it to the camera. Yeah, and so. It's like not getting a reaction, and it almost seems like needy, like you want my totally. attention now, but totally. you're not. You know what I mean? Um, but that I, I think that's just like end of the battle, adrenaline, and all that. But it did feel like, oh, you you might be trying to overplay your defense because mm -hmm. it might yeah. you have that feeling of losing might be yeah. there, you know? Yeah. But. Both did amazing. It was really good. Crazy I like battle. I liked seeing um I liked seeing levity shoddy in mm -hmm. the first round. Yeah, me too. Um I also like seeing just more direct attacking, which we get glimpses of that all the time, but just more direct attacking shuffle. Yeah. Um Shoddy going for the throat second round was crazy. And Shuffle just brought it home, I, I feel like, in the third. Word. Really well. Yeah. Hell yeah, Crazy great battle. Yeah. Just say, he so just that shuffle, he thinks he I feel like Shuffle just felt more in his element. It just looked like he just seemed more comfortable. Shoddy? Yeah. No, no, shuffle. Uh, shuffle. Shuffle? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I agree with that. Shuffle feel, seemed more relaxed. Yeah, yeah, there was like, it was almost so like nervousness. Yeah. Like so much yeah. movement. It's like, damn, you feel uncomfortable. And I'm, honestly, especially because it was so heightened in the third, is probably because of that, like, near stumble or whatever yeah. that you yeah, know kind of totally. awkward moment in the second because mm -hmm. you're just like thinking about it mm -hmm. and then he's going in you know what i mean yeah like, um really good battle though that second round of shuffle the graveyard phone conversation mm -hmm. so working good. at the grave hr at the graveyard so good that was so good amazing yeah. battle salute to yeah. premiere also you mean to tell me he's battling them to death like on the right. Yeah, so also, <laughs> though, Blur won that battle. Mm. Didn't win the war, 
but won that battle of that week because they did a thing where they dropped their single the same day. Like Blair announced it that they were going to drop the same day as Oasis. Oasis moved their date. Blair moved it to Oasis' his new date. Oh my and God, then really? so then it was like a huge news story that. where you walk yeah. into record stores and there's yeah. like the posters of Blair. The po- and Blair sold more records and it was like oh, announced. So oh shit. It, it was reflected here. You know yeah. what I mean? Shuffle. You know, the posh the posh win in this one. They might Damn. not win the war, but they won the battle. You know what I mean? Damn, that's nuts. <clears throat> that was so good. Yeah, salute to Premier. Salute to Shoddy. Salute to Shuffle, everybody over out there in the UK, bruv. Bruvs. If you're in the UK, Catch Atmosphere and Zoo opening up for them. Do you know the date of that May show? 11th in London. Yeah. And then um, if you go on Zoo to build, uh, on Instagram, you'll see all the dates or Atmosphere's page. Come yeah. on. Yeah. Follow the bull. Fuck yeah. Salute to all these gents for joining us tonight. Um Hell yeah. Go subscribe to the Patreon, patreon.com forward slash Ilmac TV to see all the episodes of Me While on Earth. And there's a new song dropping every single week that you could only get there for fucking a long time. I don't know how long you're going to yeah. go. but Six he is, songs up now. I mean, it's private playlist just for the squad on Patreon. Stop. Ain't going to Dropping one every week. And there might be some other content rhyming with Brazing the Car. Oh, pretty mm. soon, you know, yeah. I can do this. It's easy. Come man. on, it's easy. You should write a book. <laughs> <laughs> I've been, I've been yeah. doing that. Yeah. Um, but yeah, guys, salute to everybody in the chat. Appreciate y'all joining us, and uh, we'll, we're gonna be live tomorrow, I think, uh, doing a watch with Hollow. So tune into that. All right, peace out, guys. Peace.